Well, look who's joined us again. Previous Deputy Independent Counsel Saul Backslash Swaysenberg Merry Christmas Sal, have a happy Hanukkah. I'm glad to see you, too, Liz, and I'm glad to hear that the FBI called the internal emails and Twitter files, conspiracy theories. Does it imply that you know? All the texts from Elon Musk Barry Weiss is a Muslim. Schellenberger, Michael Fong Lee they are all conspiracy theorists, and if they are, they are correct conspiracy theorists, which is the most alarming. This most recent information, which was revealed by journalist Schellenberger, is the most alarming of all because it clearly demonstrates that the FBI is actively waging a disinformation campaign to influence the outcome of the 2020 election. What's even more amazing is that they are working for an administration and actively attempting to overthrow that administration by spreading false information about the Joe Biden story. The FBI calls the internal emails, which are essentially the factual text. Messages, disinformation, but the FBO FBI won't say if it spoke to the Biden campaign before the 2020 election, it won't essentially talk about whether it provided Twitter with information about Hunter Biden, and it's refusing to talk about the other social media companies that paid it paid Twitter nearly three and a half million dollars for the work it did for the FBI. Therefore, you should be aware that the FBO FBI didn't. Theodore Biden several former US government intelligence agents working across Silicon Valley saw former FBI officials at Twitter former CIA agents inside and up to no good. Hunter Hunter. Biden but what did these people do I mean this is just I don't know how you can say it other than it's it's a cabal and it's a deeply corrupt cabal there should be a thorough leadership house cleaning at the bureau we won't see it in this administration but it's going to come. I mean, if this story is true, well, you know how the FBI and, to a lesser extent, the CIA operate, and the only thing different about this is that they've finally infiltrated the high-tech industry. You see, for years, they did this with military contractors, and they would go to work the retiring agents would go to work, and all kinds of hanky-panky went on, so what's new about it is that it's high-tech and it's these media. If you loved the video please hit a like button and don't forget to subscribe the channel.